Ladies and gentlemen, we are fishing a beautiful river called the Big Wood in Idaho. We're fishing with good friend Larry Hardy. We're expecting to catch some rainbows, possibly some browns. Stick around, I think it'll be a great show. We entered the beautiful Sun Valley in Idaho with great anticipation. And soon we we're casting into the Big Wood River. I think they're right up tucked in that bank, don't you? Yeah, I think so too. Getting Especially ice build up. Sunshine. Yeah, have you gotten any hits out further? Nope, nothing in the in the edges. Yeah. Right at the seam, it's I don't think that's where they're picking anything up, but yeah, they might. Oh, there's one. That was on this side. Nice. Yeah. Steve had hooked into a fish and was working to get the fish on the reel. Get him on the reel here. Then he grabbed his net as he moved the fish closer. It's a decent fish. Rainbow. It's a pretty dark colored rainbow. I can't reel any further. There's too much ice in my guides. Nice. That's that's pretty. It's a really dark uh, colored rainbow. How big, Steve? Uh, probably ten. 10 inches probably. That's pretty good. Yeah, nice. nice. Nice little rainbow. Look beautiful from yeah. here. Look at this beautiful rainbow. Really nice trout. Fish. Fish. Oh, nice jumper. Woo! Woo hoo hoo! <laughs> wow. That's a good trout right there. Oh, nice wow. one. Yeah, and a jumper. Wow, cool. Woo! Well, the streamer did work, Larry. <laughs> Is that on it the streamer? It is a brown. It's a nice brown trout. Wow, yes. Woo! Cool. That thing hit, and man, it just boom out of the water. I don't know if that was on camera or not, but then it did a couple of nice other jumps. Gorgeous trout. It's the length of the inside of this bitterroot net. Wow, what a trout. Woo, yeah. That was fun. I'm glad I switched to the streamer. Laden's trying the dries, and uh, there's some fish rising up there. That fish took the streamer. I'll show you the olive streamer. I'm using a nine foot five weight fly rod with a sink tip line, and then a short leader to this olive bugger. And uh, that's got a little bead head on it. It's kind of a small streamer. But in winter time, a lot of times you want to use a smaller fly. That brown hit that fly. That was awesome. Oh boy. Yikes. Yikes. Insane. Yeah. It's crazy. I know. I'm. Cr no. <laughs> what? You snagged? Up in that tree. Oh no. I was deep in thought, pondering how to catch some fish that I saw rise. That's an oxymoron right there. How, how are you stripping it? Um, you know, mostly I would let it swing without stripping, and then at the end I would give it a couple strips. Okay. This is a pretty good situation here because I'm trying to throw my cast right up against that far bank, and all I have to do is bounce it off the snow bank. Makes it really easy. And do like Ladin, uh -huh. stay in one spot. Okay. And. Uh, do maybe a couple casts and then do a step down, you know, kind of be methodical like okay. steelhead fishing. Oh, 
There it is. Oh yeah. Oh, it's nice. a good one too. Woohoo! Jumper. Holy smokes is jumping right at me. Wow. Holy nice fish. smokes. Wow. These are <laughs> great fighters. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, these are fun fish. Fun fish. I mean, it can't be more than 10, 12 inches, but mm -hmm. just the fight these things give are crazy. It's skyrocketed. Nice. Oh, that's a gorgeous rainbow. Oh, yeah. Wow, mm -hmm. that's a nice trout. Yeah. You know, I kept working my way down, and I thought, maybe it's just getting too shallow. It only seems like there's a foot, foot and a half of water, but sure enough, it was there. Gorgeous. Awesome. Using barbless hooks, so that pops right out and we're ready to go. Still spunky, it was a fast fight and it was a skyrocketing fish. But man, look at that, mm. beautiful. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we had a fantastic time here on the Big Wood River in Sun Valley. Hope you enjoyed the show. Please join us next week for more Fishing with Ladin.